how to set up your mobile phones for video productions. It is generally a good idea to keep your mobile devices on the latest software updates. To update an iOS device like an iPhone or an iPad, go to Settings, General, Software Update to search and install the latest available software for your mobile devices. If you're on an Android device or otherwise, you can most likely do the same by going to Settings, Software Update, Download and install the latest updates. Our video resolutions refers to how large our movie will be. As they scale in size, so does the storage. The most common resolutions that we work with today are 720 High Definition or HD, 1080 Full HD, and 4K Ultra HD. A video segment shot in 4K Ultra High Definition can be roughly four times of one shot in 1080 HD resolution. From a production point of view, the option to shoot 4K might only be limited to newer mobile devices, but doing so gives us the option to go back to crop in our videos in post without losing much quality. Therefore, when it comes to resolution, you have to consider a compromise between available mobile storage capacity and the desired quality resolution. It is important to note that at the time of this course, most people don't choose or even have access to watching 4K videos. If you're working on an iPhone or an iPad, go to Settings, Camera, Record Video to see a list of available resolutions on the mobile device. On an Android device or otherwise, go to your main camera app under Settings, Videos to see a list of your video size. With your video resolutions in mind, we can now decide what frame rate to record the video in. Frame rate refers to how many individual frames per second a video records. The higher the number, the more smoother looking video you produce. Some of the more common settings are 30 frames per second, 60 frames per second, and less commonly, 24 frames per second. In this picture, we see a difference in the motion blur present in two different frame rates. A compelling reason to shoot at a lower frame rate is that at 24 frames per second, it is just above the low end of what our brain perceives as smooth looking video, and as a result, can provide a pleasing cinematic look for some viewing audience. At 60 frames per second, you will be able to achieve the most smooth-looking video production. 